Hey guys, I'm at a park down the street from my house, joined by Mr. Lucky, our handsome 10-month-old golden retriever boy. Yes, you are. The boy. And today we're kind of recapping what we've done the past two days that he's been with us. So, tone recall. Tap the D button. Means come to the human, whether they're stationary or moving. Stay. So, stay. Until released or recalled. Good boy. Nice job, buddy. You're so smart. He's a really, really smart guy. And today we're adding in a new command, a new kind of concept, following. This will turn into a heel. You can see pretty easily why. So, Lucky knows recall. When I say come or tap the tone or both, he knows to come and stay at my feet. What we're gonna do today is add in some movement. So, I'm going to be away from him. He'll be out there on break or in a stationary command, like a sit down or stand. I will say come, tap the tone, and start to move backwards. And it's his job to follow me. If he stays connected with me and follows really nicely, I can stop moving. He'll sit her down or stand at my feet and I'll praise him. If he loses focus or connection with me, look this way, goes that way after a squirrel, I will tap the tone, change direction, get him following me, keep him on his toes. So let's get started. He's in a stationary, he chose to lie down right there, so I'm gonna take it. I'm going to say, come, tap the tone, and move backwards. Good boy. Nice job. He goes past me, I change direction, and tap. Good job. Tapped again for sniffing and for downing. Good boy, there you go. When he's successful for a while, like here, I'm gonna stop and praise him. Good boy. So the sequence always ends with him in a stationary at my feet. Good boy. Nice job. Then I'll release him. Break, come on, break, go! Yay, woohoo! He can play with Taco for a while. Good boy. Nice job. Good boy. You can see how this could easily turn into this, healing. Hey, buddy. 